All right, we're going on your hike to Jones Valley Nature Trail. You're right here at the Southeast Church of the Nazarene. It says joy to the world. You leave big city and boom, all of a sudden you're in the woods. Coming over here and here's where your hike starts. You'll have 12 miles of wonderland outside the big city. If you feel like you're invading a church, but you're not. The trails are right there. See you on the trails. All right, y'all. Y'all ready for a hike? We found a place over here in South Huntsville in the Jones Valley. I don't think a lot of people know about, but there's quite a bit of hiking right here. You're right outside of this big city where Target and a bunch of convenient places are. This is gonna be amazing. You're in the Land Trust of North Alabama. And uh, I'll show you just a little bit about it. Let's hit the trail. Let's have a good time, yeah. All right, this is the Blevins Gap Nature Preserve. It says there's 12 miles here, but there's a bunch of little shorter ones all in this area. Come check it out. It's pretty cool. Let's go enjoy it. Whoosh. JT, what do you want to tell everybody? We'll see you in a minute. Yeah. Go, go, go. So this is a beautiful trail. You can tell a lot of people don't get on it even though it's right here in the middle of everything. Check it out, the leaves everywhere. When the people are all on it, you can't, can't do that to the leaves. These leaves have been on this ground for a while. So we're doing just a little three quarters of a mile loop. Looks like it's very accessible for bikers. I love to come mountain bike this. And definitely hikers, nice and smooth. Very cool. Beautiful runoff creek right there. Very nice. It might be fun to go hike in. I'll go get out in it a little bit. Walk on some rocks. So it looks like the about half of it is just straight up. Not real steep, but very doable by, by any, almost anybody. You can walk the creek, look at this, yeah. Very cool. I ain't gonna leave people behind, they're up ahead. So this is, yeah, great drainage creek right here. Right next to the trail, kind of pretty. Gotta like it. Still on the Jones Valley Loop. So when you're walking up this side, all we do is just walk straight up and then you cross over and you come straight back down. Right over there, somebody going up the other side. Nice little trail. This will be fun to bike. I bet it'll be fast coming down. It doesn't seem like there's much traffic at all. Let's go get him. I'm gonna get you, JT. <laughs> I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. Good job, good job. Whoa! A little steep spot, how bad? Pretty back here. I can do some 
It's got these cool little puddles along the way. It's warm, but they're full of crawfish and fish. Could be cool. Look what we found, JT. Yeah. There's a waterfall up there, too. Cool. Listen. Whoosh. Almost there, there she is. Nice jump. Up there. Nice. Keep going, big guy. Go, 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 run by! Go fish! Let me go feel the waterfall for a second. <clears throat> yeah! Feel the waterfall. Bunch of little ones. It's really fun in the summer. I like it now because you don't have to worry about the fire. Bugs. No bugs! I want to feel it and see how deep it is over there. Well, come on. Mommy. And we got to catch Mama <laughs> But she's coming back. Yay. What are you going to say? We'll see you on the next adventure. <laughs> yeah. What do you think, Mama? It really is, right here next to the city. It's not really travel very much. Let's check it out. It's the halfway point of the Jones Valley Loop. And it splits off the Bailey Cove Trail. And take off that way up that mountain. 12 miles of hiking out here. Really pretty. So we're going to take and cross the creek and come down the other side of it oh. that's pretty cool what do you think jt you like that cool i remember last time you did this you had a tough time coming up here did you know that yeah. that was pretty easy this time you gonna take a nap no <laughs> i just like this new chair and drop the creek all right there's two ways to get across the creek one's to jump it one's to go across the log i'm gonna go across the log yes Welcome to the JT Show. I am going to cross this little creek. So, well, I'm gonna try to do it. So you step on a big rock, like I am on right now. Then you step on a 
little rock and keep one foot on the big rock. And then step on another rock and balance yourself onto the big rock and the little rock. So now I'm gonna drop and that's the way to get across the big rock. All right, all right, we'll see you in a minute. Now, now we're on the other side of the creek. We're going to the car now. So, let me show you the creek now. It's way down there. I don't know if you can see it or not, but it is down there. We'll see you in a minute. All right, so now we're going on the other side of the creek. We're going to head nothing but downhill. And you could mountain bike some of this, but there's some parts that are really sketchy. <clears throat> quite, a, quite a bit of drops and things. I don't know, maybe mountain bike it, but you might be getting off of your bike just a little bit. But it's all downhill now. Nice, easy, yet fun hike. A little bit of rock climbing there. Boosh, nice jump. May have to hop a little bit here and there. So it's not for everybody, but it's short if you take your time. I think just about anybody that's mobile oh, can come up here and do this with a little bit of effort. It'll be great. Let's do this. Come on, big boy. So one of the things I don't like about hiking in the summer is all the thorns and bugs. But it's winter time and look, they're still here. Big old thorns, you gotta be careful going through your trails if they're not highly treaded upon or walked upon you could run into something like that and it would mess up your day yeah so be careful when you're for the thorns like yeah. right there you yep. almost stepped them and i just felt one of them get my leg right here so you're tough though right yep okie dokie let's go find mama mama keeps trying to hide from us so that pool down there, the last time we came, is full of golf balls. So there must be a golf course up there somewhere. Maybe when it storms or rains. I don't know how they get here, but golf balls are right there. Funny, funny, funny. So we've walked down here to the little pond. And yeah, there's one golf ball. There's a golf ball right there. <laughs> Come on down, buddy. Look at it. So there's some leaves all on the bottom. Imagine it's covering up the rest, but it's full of golf balls. Cool. <laughs> so here's a good skipping rock. Let's skip this rock. Are you ready? Yeah. Let's go and get it skipping. Oh yeah, it bounced. <laughs> what do you think about that? Maybe we can walk underneath Whoa. it. <laughs> okay. I know you are. Come on. You gonna come down here with me? Yes. Be careful now. That that rock was cold. I'm being careful. I can still do the cool moves. This is kind of scary to me. <laughs> but it is still cool to me, y'all. Good job. There. You made it. Woohoo! Ooh, look what we found. Another tree to cross. Whoosh. <laughs> It's a long drop. I can do this. 
All right, it's your turn. You can stand up if you hold your arms out, or you can do that too. <laughs> what do you think, Mama? Are you worried about your boy? No. <laughs> yes, you are. <laughs> All right, cool little spot. This is probably the best spot down here if you want some adventure. Climb right under the bridge, doing your thing. Come check it out. It's fun. <laughs> He's excited. We almost died. Yep. So three quarters of a mile. Pretty easy. Fun. A little bit sketchy. A little bit slippery. Good stuff. What y'all think? Y'all like this? Good yeah. trail? Yeah. Good trail. Good trail. Come out. Check it out. There's 12 miles total. So another 11 you know, miles and three quarters left that I we didn't even come close to. I think we're... I think we are on the green trail, and first we were on the red trail. Alrighty, alrighty. Alright, we'll see you back at the car, and see you next time. If you like this stuff, like and subscribe. Alright, JT, we made it back. We want to tell everybody. We'll see you tomorrow on the next adventure. <laughs> All right, when you get done with your hike, you are literally seconds, not minutes, but seconds from big city. You're in Jones Valley, a Target, all types of good food to eat, Longhorn, all types of things. You can come up here and get a fleet feet, get you some new hiking shoes, but it's really kind of neat because you're right here next to everything, but you can feel like you're out in the middle of the wilderness. So. We'll see you next time. Thank you for watching.